Hello everyone and welcome to episode 103 of this Let's Play series of Star Trek Online. My name is Winters and you are very welcome. Uh, we are moving on to the next mission in the Delta Quadrant story arc, which is the Kabali Front. Um, are you familiar with the Kabali? Their homeworld is under attack by the Vardwar and they've requested our aid. I informed the head of their military that you would render them support on the ground. Their city has been under siege for months and cannot take much more. Please do what you can on Kabali Prime to stop the Vardwar from destroying the Kabali. Okay, so that's basically what's going on. The Vodwar are attacking uh, Kabali Prime, so I have already set course for Kabali, and we are outside it here now. So we're going to jump in. Now, um, Kabali Prime is... what is it? It's an adventure zone. Um, uh, it's a level... Uh, I think it's level 4. 50 might be 60 we'll see when we beam down uh, but it's kind of like the uh, Dyson Sphere ground battle zone in fact it's very much like it um, the the whole area the whole map is uh, one giant battlefield so we'll go through a few of the missions here now and um, yeah check it out hello I'm Captain Harry Kim Starfleet's military liaison to Kabali Prime the Vodwar have been assaulting the Kabali homeworld for months now. The Kabali are near a breaking point. They're not trained for war. Not like the Vodwar. The Alliance is here to stop the Vodwar and help the Kabali reclaim their home. You and several others will be leading our forces here. I'll be doing some investigations to help support the effort. Good luck. Okay, so there we had Ensign, or actually uh, Captain Harry Kim, voiced by Garrett Wong. Um, yeah, so anyway, uh, the the mission Kabali Prime actually just requires us basically to talk to this NPC. That's it, it's end of mission. I cannot tell you how good it is to have you here. Our people have been bombarded by the Vod War for months. We cannot take much more of this. Before you go out to the field, I would ask your help within the city. Morale is at an all-time low, and our people could use a boost. We can't stop until the Vodwar leave our world. Okay, so the next mission is going to be the cavalry. We've been this war for nearly a year now, and it's taking a toll on our troops. We are a peaceful people. This is the first time my soldiers have been exposed to death and destruction on this scale. They're demoralized and depressed concerned about the long-term effects on their mental health. You have more experience than we do in battle. It would help if you could speak to our soldiers and share your insights. Please stop by the med bay. Some of the wounded there have asked to meet you. Okay, so we're going to get some Delta Marks and experience for this mission. We can't stop until... So, let's uh, zoom in here on uh, our mini-map. Uh, I'm going to set this as our primary mission. And, uh, yeah, we're going to go to uh, the med bay, and we're going to talk to some injured Kabali. So, it is in this room here, and uh, there's a number of Kabali You're part of the around. I'm not going to listen to everybody. Fifth time. You guys can do that. Uh, you only have to go up to three My of them. Brother. Thank you. It may not many groups. Okay, and our next part then is to go around this way. And uh, I think, yeah, it's this NPC here, if I remember correctly. Reporting and for duty, sir. It is a pleasure to watch you in action, sir. They give us another mission. Basically, we have to inspire the troops. Because they're so depressed from getting their ass handed to them. Um, yeah, so that's it. We just have to run around a few different locations. I think it's three different locations. They're marked on the mini map up here in uh, yellow. Uh, there's another group over there, so that's who we're going to go to next. And that will be the end of this bit. Wow, I haven't seen the pictures today. Alrighty. Uh, 
do we talk to this guy now? This is we Captain can't Kim. stop. No. Ah, oh, it's Harry Kim. Okay, so it's Harry that we have to talk to. And Harry is up here. Permission to speak freely. Something isn't right here. I've done some investigating, and I don't think the Kabali are being entirely truthful with us. Not so much found as observed. The Vodwa clearly have superior firepower, tactics, and training, right? So why haven't they already wiped the Kabali out? They haven't hesitated to do so in other worlds. Sure, the Kabali have a shield around the capital, but they've been fighting the Vodwa for months now and they're consistently losing troops and territory. I don't understand how the Vaudoir haven't already taken the capital and finished this. Exactly. There has to be some other objective for the Vaudoir here, and we need to find out what it is. We have to help the Kabali, and we can't do it if we're blinded. Understood. I won't let you down. Okay, so Harry suspects that there is something else going on we can't stop until we thank you for your assistance your presence here means we're not fighting alone anymore that's more important than you know my son is in the trenches now and he could use your wait what's that The Vodwar are at the gates. You have to help us. Alrighty, so now we have to repel the Vodwar attacking the gates. So uh, we go down um, these steps, and um, <clears throat> it doesn't matter what side you pick here. You can pick this side or uh, the other side here. And um, yeah. Basically, we just have to fight off the waves of Vodbor that are coming in. And now we have to aid some wounded uh, Kabali soldiers. Of course, not forgetting to pick up our loot. Here's our third guy. Now, one thing about the VOD war, they can be tricky little guys. Um, so, it's something to watch out for. Um, you will often get one Vodwar that will reinforce the shields of another Vodwar and uh, the one that's getting um, its shields reinforced will be 100% immune to your damage. Excellent. Okay, that's that. Uh, look for more Vodwar attackers on bridge. Return... Ah, right, okay. Kim here. Something definitely isn't right. The general is waiting for you. I'll keep trying to figure this out. Okay, so now we go back to the general. We can turn it in and get the next part. That was too close. If you hadn't been here, your stand against the Vaudoir will give our people the motivation they need to keep fighting. We have so much more to do. If the Vaudoir made it this far, then I fear for my son in the trenches. 
We can't stop until the Vadwar leave our world. My son Jatanian is commanding our forces outside the city. The Vadwar should never have reached us without so much as a warning from him. Something must have happened. Here is his position in the field. Take the nearby transporter and make your way to his command post. He may need assistance. Okay, so let's we accept that. Until the Again, I'm gonna make this primary. And down we go to the main entrance. And this here is a transporter pad, and we should be able to take the transporter out to the trenches. Nope, alright, we can't, I was wrong about that. But what we did just do is actually unlock that location. So, uh, if we come to a transporter out here, which we will, um, we can then use that transporter to instantly get back into the city. We're hanging in there, but we could use your help. I am, although I understand your confusion. Kabali reproduced by reanimating corpses and then integrating them into our society. We're assigned to existing family groups who teach and care for us. My first life was a long one. I don't remember it, however. I am Kabali, and my father is a source of inspiration and wisdom for me. My people do not reproduce in what you... This isn't... Yes. Okay, I'm just... I'm skipping past that because we would be here all night. Um, okay, our next objective is tell scared troops to get back into the fight. So, um, yeah, we're basically looking for cowering Kabali, like this guy. Or girl. So we just have to run around the highlighted area. You can see there's an area highlighted here on the minimap. And... Um, yeah, we just have to uh, um, go up to Kabali and get their asses back in the fight. Because um, cowardice will not be tolerated. And one more. Thank you. Alright, look for information by defeating Vodwar or cracking their crates. Okay, uh, again, there's another, or well, it's actually pretty much the same area as highlighted. Um, so, uh, yeah, uh, I believe this is what we're looking for. Oh no, it's not. Let's uh, let's kill some Kabali, or not Kabali, but oh my God, what do you? What am I saying? Some Vodbar. So we'll just Leroy Jenkins into the middle of the uh, the Vodbar lines. And uh, if anybody doesn't know the story of Leroy Jenkins, you need to look it up because it is absolutely hilarious. God dang it. Okay, kill that guy, get out of here. Oh, he just didn't want to give up, did he? Uh, confer with your bridge officers. Okay, come on back. Disable Vodbar devices. Okay, there is a number of them highlighted on the map. Ooh, this doesn't look good. Okay, I'm sorry about that, folks. I had a crash to desktop, or uh, CTD, and um, yeah, I'm just after getting back in the game. So anyway, um, our next objective uh, requires us to disable some Vodward devices, and they are marked on our minimap. Um, so I am going to head to the first one now. Ok, 
Okay, there's the device. I'm just going to clear the area of the Vaudoir. And then we will uh, scramble the uh, transport inhibitor. Ah, dang it. I hate that. Let's try again for a second time. Got it. Okay, moving on to the next one. Ooh. Let's uh, use a hypo. Oh, I need a much stronger one. There we go. Alright, back in the fight. So anyway, yeah. Um, what was I talking about before all that happened? Oh, I was talking about Leroy Jenkins. Um, so, God, I have to try and remember this now. Um... I believe this was uh, on WoW, um, and uh, there was a raid going to happen, or being planned, and uh, these group of guys um, spent ages planning this raid that they were going to do on WoW, and <laughs> they were only in the middle of their planning, and one of the guys, and his name was Leroy Jenkins, <laughs> he, he just went straight off and ran in and started doing the raid all on his own and as he ran in he went Leroy Jenkins <laughs> and absolute pandemonium followed and <laughs> if you can find it on YouTube it is the funniest thing ever and uh, yeah so that is a, br a brief uh, version of the Leroy Jenkins story it is absolutely fantastic oh man okay so oh crap Man, I was near death. Alright, I have to go back here. Ah, so this is it. Here's the transporters. So we're going to activate them. Remember now, we have unlocked the transporter in the city. So now we can take this transporter back to the city. And there we are, just off the transporter. Um, okay, so let's go and talk to Harry Kim. I've been noticing something strange. When I first met the Kabbali, they didn't seem to be a particularly religious people. Lindsay, Jedliah, I mean, certainly didn't say anything about it. However, now, Almost every Kabali I've met follows one creed. And there's a temple located just beyond the trenches. I've tried to find out more about their practices, but they keep telling me it's forbidden to share them with outsiders. Maybe, but I don't remember the Vodwar having a particular belief system either. This may not be much, but I'll continue my investigations. Maybe this one is a dead end. Okay, so let's go back to the general, turn in this mission, and get our next one. The Vodwar shut down the transporter. We can't okay, stop um, until the Vodwar. Ah, I'm sorry, but could you return later? I believe you need a break. You've already done so much for us. We couldn't possibly ask you for more. I think we can't stop. Okay. Um, let's go and speak to Harry Kim again. I've discovered a few interesting things that can help us with the Kabbali. Do you have anything on your end? I've been thinking. Our only way to find out what the Kabbali are hiding is through the Vodwa. We need to find out where they're focusing their attacks, and then why. That may be able to shed some light on the situation. Yes. My crew was looking into why our signal jammers weren't working, and we found that the Vodwar have comm beacons in all of their camps that act as a miniature subspace array. They can't be jammed because they're shielded, and they provide all the Vodwar need for controlled, secure communications. Ingenious, really. I wonder if the Starfleet Corps of Engineers could whip up something like that for us. If Bellana were here, I'm sure she could. Anyway, if we could place a trace on one of the Vodwar beacons... Exactly. Once we find out where the Vodwar plan to attack, 
We can reinforce the Kavali and find out what, if anything, they're hiding. There are four communications arrays in the trenches area. Planting a trace on each of them should allow the engineers on your ship to spy on the Vodwar. Okay, so that's what's going on. Um, I'm gonna look at my inventory. Ooh, let's uh, let's go back to the bank here. By the way, th this is a uh, bank and mail access. Um, that's the mail. This is the bank. And uh, yeah, just in case you need it, um, like I really do now, because I need to free up some space. Uh, other things can go in. Anything else? Doesn't look like it. Okay. Um, I can get rid of these. Uh, discard. And I can get rid of these. Discard. Alright, so I freed up some space. Right. Um, let's see, where do we need to go? Um, we should be able to take the transporter back out. We should be pretty close to our objective. Uh, Alright, there's one right here. Looks like we're gonna have to fight our way in. That's no problem. We'll get there eventually. So there are um, different areas to the map, um, just like the uh, Dyson Sphere ground battle zone. Uh, you know, you have to do certain objectives to uh, capture areas, and uh, yeah, it's uh, very similar um, in that. But the story demands that we do these little side missions that are um, set up for us. And there's a number of these missions, actually, uh, little flavor missions that you can pick up and um, you can uh, do as you wish. But they're not part of the main story. Uh, they're more like you know just background and uh, of some of the characters and things that are going going on, history, that sort of stuff. So if you wish to do any of those missions, feel free. I will not be doing them on this playthrough. Yeah, was, uh, oh, I need a hypo, need a hypo, need a hypo. Whew. Okay, let's get into the medical generator here and we'll just heal up. Okay, we're healed up enough. And we're coming up on the trenches now. was weird. Alright, so we place another trace on this thing. What happens if... Uh, I don't really want to take part in... Th this is a capture uh, point. Basically, you stay here, fight off uh, waves of Vodwar, and... Um, you capture the point. Um, I don't really want to do this. Let's see how it goes here. No, not another crash to desktop. Okay, sorry about that, folks. I had another crash to desktop. Um, there is clearly something going on with this map and my system. Um, so I'm very, very sorry about this. 
because I know that it, you know it might be a little bit confusing. One minute we're in battle, and the next minute um, uh, you know we're just taken out of it. Uh, I, I'm going to try and uh, get through this as quickly as possible. So I am just going to haul ass to uh, the uh, last point. Um, I am going to engage these guys, however, and hopefully give my bridge officers a chance to catch up. Because they're up there fighting. I'm being stupid like. Now, do you see what that Vodwar is doing? He's reinforcing the shields of another Vodwar, making him 100% invincible to all my damage. Dang it! Uh, there's got to be an easier way to get. I guess I, have, I just have to go through the trenches. Um, we'll fight our way through. So you can see that guy was reinforcing the shields of the other guy, so... Um, yeah, you just have to take out the guy that's doing the reinforcing. Ooh! Hidden Accolade! Jump into one of these things, and... Uh, yeah, you get a Hidden Accolade called Transporter Pod Examiner. Um, they're transporter pods. Um, they're basically launched from a ship in orbit, and then they come down and bury themselves on the ground, and they're transporter pads. Uh, it's actually quite a clever idea. And this map actually has a ton of hidden accolades. So, um, yeah, if uh, you're accolade hunters, you may want to uh, check out the map in detail. Hey, I've been revived. Okay, uh, where is... here he is. Let's revive Alyssa. Let her get healed up. And then we'll go. Actually, I want to check the map. Uh, oh, I really should be going this way. I think. Getting close. See, he's doing it again. You can see the immune coming up on that guy. Of course, it's gone now. But I'm sure you've seen it. Um, Excellent. We're getting real close now. Just being careful here for this last bit, because the last thing I want is to die when we're about to get into the area that we need to be. And I really hope I don't get another crash to desktop. Send information to ship. Your time Excellent. Is a large squad of armed Kabali just left, but they wouldn't say where they were going. Did you find any information? The temple. All right, let's kill these guys because uh, I cannot afford to listen to Harry Kim at the minute. Pick up our loose. Okay, uh, we have to go in this direction, so let's go the way we came. All 
Alright, so this part we have to complete open mission temple defense. Oh, right. Um, really, we should be coming across that bridge. That is ideally the route that we should be taking. Um, but, uh, yeah, we're, we're not. We're coming in the back end. Um, doesn't matter. We'll fight our way in. Hopefully we can pull it off. Oh, God, we're down uh, one of our bridge officers as well. Crud. Okay, so let's uh, get in position. Defend Kabali Temple from Vodwar. So this is the very same thing again. We just stand in this box and we defend it from attacking Vodwar. Simple as that. Near to drop a medical generator. Let us heal up. Nearly there. Congratulations. Excellent. All right, we can hail the Harry. The temple is secure and the doors to it are still open? This... Okay. Uh, investigate the Kabali Temple interior. That is going here. So uh, it's called Dragon's Teeth. Looks like we've made it to the lowest level of the temple. Let's see what's in there. Okay, I'm gonna zoom in the map a little bit. Oh, back up. Scan downed Kabali. Where is he? Oh, there he is. Oh, God, he's crushed. And uh, basically, we just have to fight our way in, um, which, you know, it's not that very difficult at this stage of the game for us, anyway. Excellent. Can't really see anything in that room. So remember now, we're allies of the Kabali, but, uh, and this is a, a temple of theirs, apparently, and we're finding Vogwar down here, and they're trying to get in somewhere, and um, yeah, so uh, they were trying to cut through this door. Thank you. Take the... Use codes to open door.
Let's uh, zoom in here. What's that look like to you? Because that looks like a Vod War to me. So, shouldn't be surprised that the Kabali are using Vod War bodies to create more Kabali. I never imagined that we would find this. The Vod War aren't fighting the Kabali over territory. They want their people back. This is why the Kabali stopped wandering. Everything they needed was here. It's not right. Some of the Vodwar in the stasis tubes could still be revived. The Vodwar are a dying race. Their methods may be extreme, but they're doing what they think they need to do to survive, just like the Gabali are. Okay. I'm glad you agree with me. We need to take this information to the general and get him to explain why they hid this from us. If the Kabali had been up front with us from the start, we could have figured out a better solution for this. So we're going to go and uh, talk to the general. So it seems like basically, um, yeah, the Kabali have been taking the uh, uh, bodies of the deceased uh, Vodwar. General, we know about the temple. When were you going to tell us? Secrecy protected our future, Captain. How are we supposed to help you if you won't even tell us what the problem is? That's enough, Captain. Captain Drolly, you're late. The Kazon delayed me. What's the situation? I see. Captain Kim, no matter our personal feelings, we must follow the Prime Directive. We are not here to change the Kabali culture. We are here to protect them. We'll talk more about this in private. I'm sure we'll see you again soon. Okay, so let's turn in the mission. I'm sorry. For everything. We never should have lied. But you're an outsider. And we've learned from past experience that not everyone can accept or even understand what we accept as necessary. I couldn't risk losing your support. It won't happen again. I'll give you all the information you need. The Vodwar will not stop, even if we return the remaining stasis pods. You know they won't. Look what they've done to the Turei. Even the Krenin have fallen. I'll give you some time. We'll talk again when I have more information on our next move. Okay. We can't stop <clears throat> until the Vodwar leave our world. So, um, I think we'll leave it there for this episode. Um, the next episode will just continue on um, exploring uh, the, f the full area. Um, we've got to about uh, here. This is kind of the area that we explored so far. Uh, but yeah, in the next episode we'll... Um, explore more of the area and we'll eventually get to um, the different types of uh, activities or things you have to do to capture areas uh, hopefully in the next episode um, and again I apologize for the uh, uh, crash to desktops as well that I got I got two of them I hope I don't get any more but anyway um, yeah we'll leave it there for this episode uh, I hope you all enjoyed it if you did please leave a like comment and subscribe to the channel my name is Winters and I will see you next time so until then take care